It's food o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer and following on from the vegan Costa cheese and ham toasty, which we just put up on the channel, please check that out, is the Costa all day breakfast panini. This has vegan sausage, baked beans, mushroom, and a dairy free alternative to cheese. So let's get it out. I, I thought whilst I was there, I've, I've never been to a Costa before, so Whilst I was in there buying the toasty, I thought I might as well check out this vegan panini at the same time. So here's a look at it. Nice and warm um, still, which is great. Looks, looks really good. Let's get it open for you to see. Look at that. So sausage, beans, cheese, mushrooms. That looks all right, doesn't it? Get it there. Let's dive in. Mm. So far some beans. The bread rolls lovely. Lovely hot panini. Mm. Let's grab some sausage. There it is. <clears throat> Let's dive into that. It's like a Cumberland. Cumberland flavoured vegan sausage. Probably some, I might probably say on there what it is. We'll get to that in a moment, but it, good texture to the sausage. Uh, loads of herbs and spices and very Cumberland like. Cheese, tasting pretty good, beans, pretty good, it's not bad this, it's not a bad alternative, if you've decided to go vegan for Veganuary, um, this, this could be, I think, I'm going to be honest, already, I think I would prefer Costa's Toasty, I think there's it's got a little bit more flavour, it's got a little bit more, the the ham's like really smoky, vegan ham, really, really smoky, the cheese is really melty, um, I think the beans have, have I don't know, they, they seems to have not helped, the bits of, what is that, that's bits of potato as well. Oh. Or vegetable or something. That's weird. I'm going to get some more of that out. Yeah, that's potato. It's quite sourdough, sea batter, she batter, however you pronounce it, um, water, extra virgin olive oil, oil, salt, yeast. Sourdough, where's all the proper ingredients? Baked beans, tomato puree, sugar. Oh, come on. Vegan sausage, 12%. Mushroom, wheat shredded, or wheat shredge. Starch. God, there's so many ingredients here. Pea protein, onion, potato flakes and potato starch, black pepper, coconut oil. So the potato, I think they call potato flakes. What? I'm gonna dig this out, there's a big bit. Sorry for my dirty fingers from getting in there. That's more than a potato flake. That's a potato cube. I mean, you've got to have a bit of potato in, a, in an all day breakfast, whether it be a wrap or a panini.
it's nice. It's it's nice, but I'm I'm kind of like Yeah, I'm a little disappointed with this, if I'm perfectly honest. I think when you walk past the Costa, the only reason I knew about this was walking past it, a big sign outside, advertising the ham and cheese toasty. So I think they knew they were onto a winner with the ham and cheese toasty. So they thought, that's great, we'll advertise that over the panini. I think maybe it's just by accident, maybe they just produced a better product in the cheese and ham toasty. Vegan cheese, I've got to keep mentioning vegan. Vegan cheese and ham toasty. It's a much, much better product. It's, everything just seems to work there. I'll give it a nine out of 10. I really, really enjoyed it. This just seems like they've just thrown a load of stuff in together and nothing's quite working. Nothing's, do you know when, when you've had an all day breakfast roll and there's an egg in there and it's burst and it's running all over the sausage and the bacon and the hash brown that might be in there and it just, it just works. Let's, let's take for example the other, one of the other big firms out there, McDonald's breakfast wrap. McDonald's breakfast wrap is one of the most incredible things you can buy from any takeaway, any, any fast food joint. It's really good. It just works. It's just really good. Red or brown sauce, absolutely terrific. I'm a massive fan. I know this is a vegan version, but this just seems so far away. So far away from being anything like a breakfast roll. If they called this a cheesy bean, cheesy baked bean sausage roll, I kind of get it. It's too beany. It's too kind of tomato sauce, kind of like to to be not to pat tomato ketchup, but tomato sauce that come in comes in bean juice. It's much more of that flavour over being all day breakfast. I think they can improve on it. I think in time, when things evolve, the sausage might get a little bit more like sausage. The bacon might be a little bit more I mean, there's not even any bacon in it. To call it an all-day breakfast panini, I'm not having any, even if it's vegan bacon. I'm quite surprised. I'm quite surprised. But there we are. It can't all work. It can't all work all of the time. You can see the amount of baked beans in there. Yeah, it's just a bit weird. Try it, see what you think. For me, I think it's a work in progress. They'll probably keep improving it over time. Mm. Loads of salt as well. Big song it's thirty-five percent of your daily salt content in this roll. Wow. I'm gonna finish it, then I'm gonna rate it. Bear with me. It's a little bit of mushroom there, look. Amazing, isn't it? I mean, just to think that 50 years ago, if you if you told somebody in a Whitbread pub that in 50 years' time 
they people would be queuing out the door buying vegan breakfast rolls and a coffee <laughs> and there's no no beer in sight the company would have probably just laughed in their, in their seats you know um whip bread while i'm finishing this off whip bread brewery got out of the brewing game stopped brewing beer in the 1990s i think and opened a load of coffee stores called costa coffee and then opened a load of hotels called premier inns and brewers fair the pubs and there's no there's no beer in sight there's no beer at all anywhere Um, yeah, I've said enough about this. It's work in progress. I like it enough to give it, I'm going to give that a f 4 out of 10. Yeah, that's a 4 out of 10. Quite a disappointment to be honest. Nothing, nothing even close. I mean, at least the vegan cheese and ham toasty tasted like a cheese and ham toasty this breakfast roll panini didn't take taste anything like a breakfast roll thanks for watching if you like what you see please put your comments in the comments box subscribe to our daily beard and food reviews give us a big fat thumbs up boom cheers